Hey y'all, so I'm really, really excited to show you my jewelry collection. But wait, before you haters go and leave your little hater comments, I'm not trying to show off and I'm not trying to brag at all. This is actually requested a lot on Blog TV. So of course, to my loyal subscribers, I want to go ahead and show them. Um, also, the second thing I wanted to just kind of address, and I'm not saying this to everyone, I'm just saying this to the people who send me messages or write mean comments. Um, oddly enough, you guys might not know this, but there is an option not to watch my videos. You don't have to even click on this video. If you don't want, like watching my videos because I'm pale or because you like you don't like the way I wear my makeup, whatever reason you have for not wanting to watch my videos, you don't have to watch them. I know, that's a strange concept for some of you. But um, anyway, I also want to apologize for the amount of times I say I'm in this video. I'm really trying to consciously think about it and not say it, but there's just so many things running through my mind that sometimes it's just kind of hard. And then I play back the video and I just think to myself, was it really necessary to say um that many times? So in advance, I'm sorry for that. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I just want to show you guys what I keep most of my jewelry on. And this isn't all of it, but um, this little stand I got from TJ Maxx, I want to say it was like $15.99, it could have been more, like $20, not more than $20. Um, so you might be able to still find this there. This is like a styrofoam material kind of deal, so you can put your earrings and whatnot in here. And then I have my necklaces on either side. I'm also just going to leave this on the floor so you guys are going to see me pulling things from that. Hopefully that doesn't get too annoying or distracting. I'm going to go ahead and just show you what I have on today. So I have these little... Um, fake stud earrings that I think I got from my mom, but I'm not 100% sure, so yeah, and I don't really know where they're from. I also have on this necklace from Forever 21, just a bunch of keys, and I would have a couple more keys on there, but they fell off, so yeah. And then I have this um, ring that I never ever take off, and I got it from C28, and it says Woman of God on one side, I don't know if you guys can see that, and it says Proverbs 31 on the other. Proverbs 31 is just a Bible verse that says uh, basically how a woman of God should live her life. So I wear this ring for two reasons. I wear it just to kind of remind me of how I'm supposed to live my life from day to day. And also just to kind of remind me of C28 because it's been a year since C28 closed. And if you guys have been watching my videos, you know that it means a lot to me. So it just kind of reminds me of the friendships that I made, the people that I prayed for, um, just that whole C28 journey, so I like to just wear it as a reminder of that. And then I also have on this ring, I guess I don't really need to take it off, um, that Chase got me for my 16th birthday. It has my birthstone right here in the middle and this heart, and then it has two little diamonds on either side. So that's very special to me, and I don't really take that one off either. Um, then I have these earrings from... Chase got these for me for Christmas two years ago. And they're just the Please Return to Tiffany earrings, so love those. And then I have these little <laughs> fake Chanel earrings I got for $10 at like a cheerleading competition. And it's funny because my freshman slash sophomore years of high school, you were like the coolest person ever if you wore these earrings. Everyone wore these little Chanel earrings. Um, kind of like how white watches are really popular now, Chanel earrings were like huge. So of course I wore these all the time and you know I'd always just be like, oh yeah, just my cool earrings. like. I just thought I was just, you know, hot stuff back then. So needless to say, I don't really wear those anymore. Um, I think it's kind of funny, actually. But I wear those a lot. Then I had these little um, cat paw prints that I got from some kind of fundraiser, whatever, for school. Well, for cheerleading. Um, but we were the Wildcats, so of course you gotta rep your team. And then I have, I got this little packet from the Easter Bunny. Um, of earrings and this one is just like really pretty big flower oh, they're kind of big but I like those and then they came with these little crowns because of course you know I'm a princess have to have some crowns so those and then it also came with these little um, then I have these bigger pearls that I wear a lot um, and then Chase's grandma gave me these earrings yep I'm so excited to wear these on game day. They're going to look so cool. Um, love those. The Thinks Grands, if you're watching. Um, and then I got these little um, 
heart dangle earrings from my grandmother, so thank you. Um, these have been in my drawer for a while, and I just recently found them, and I was like, oh, I forgot about these. So I put them on my little thing, so don't forget to wear them. Um, I think, oh, I have these little bow. Actually, they're not that little. They're kind of big, but I really enjoy these. And then I got these from New York and Company on Black Friday. They're just little flowers. You can kind of tell. Yeah. Um, I think that is it for earrings. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the other two rings that I have. I got this one from Forever 21. It's kind of tarnished now, but I really like that one. And then this is my probably my favorite piece of jewelry, and I never wear it, but I should. Um, this is my nation's best ring. Uh, I was an all-star cheerleader for nine years, and my last year we got nation's best and world champions, so I am very proud of this ring. Um, so, if you're a cheerleader, you know what this is, and yeah, it is just, oh, I love it. So anyway, moving on, um, I have this white watch that I got from Target for Christmas a couple years ago, I think. I'm getting a new white watch on Saturday. I'm so excited. Um, but anyway, that one doesn't really work anymore. I, <laughs> my dad kept saying, do you have a watch for your ACTs? And I kept saying, yeah, I have this white watch. I'm going to wear it. And I put it on the night before and the battery was dead. So that didn't really help. Um, and then I have this Beloved's little, like, snap bracelet that is from c 2 as well. And I used to wear this all the time. But I don't really wear it that much anymore. Um, then I have this... Oh, I guess we're doing bracelets now. I'm just kidding. I have this bracelet from Target and it has these little glitters in them. Um, I kind of just wear it as a bangle pretty much up high. Um, how many times am I going to say um? I don't even know. The little um, glitter things fall off a lot which kind of stinks but I still like it. I think it's pretty. And then I have this little one that I think my grandma found. I can get it on. And it's just these little fake um, diamond looking things. So I wear that on occasion. So I think that's pretty. Um, I don't really have that many bracelets. I think I have one more to show you guys. And then this one I got at New York and Company on Black Friday because everything was half off. So of course, you know, 